minutes, you really need to get on with it. Get ready. Green, green, green. Hello, and welcome to iRacing. Here we are at He's on your left. Clear left. Lime Rock. There's an incident in Big Bend. Yellow flag. Caution. You get a car on your left. Left side is clear. I've decided not to qualify today, so I'm starting 22nd at a 25. Incident in left hander. And already this looks like being a good decision. Anyway, Formula V. Lime Rock Park. And the guy saying, let's have a safe race, is saying sorry in the text. Colour me shocked. So let's get a move on then. Sorry, I panicked. Seriously, these cars are so slow. 97 miles an hour. Sorry, I panicked. Right hander. Right side. Right side is clear. There's an incident in uphill. You think it might be Rocker. Eighth place. he's going to stay out of the way. His wheels are facing different directions. Ten minutes remaining. Ten minutes. So a lot of fun in these yesterday at Alton Park. Just thought today, as it's Lime Rock, makes total sense to do Lime Rock. Lime Rock's an excellent circuit for these little roller skates. But, uh, yeah, let's see. The car ahead has just done a 100.9. If they could collide again, that'd be awesome. The car in front of us is Sam. There's an incident in right hander. It looks like it's Adams. P8. These races are really quick, 12 minutes long, which means you can get into the race, finish the race, get out, get into the next race immediately. A little bit understeery there. Incredibly, considering there's no uh, wings or anything, these cars really draft. Really, really draft. He's lunging. P7. And they're good for wheel to wheel racing. They're excellent for the rookies, but the thing is with wheel to wheel racing is that happens Big ben. You think when you make contact, you crash. They're so light, it's not very resilient. Highest climber so far. 16 spots. Another 16 spots behind in Brian Blundell. There's a few in front that like they could all crash. B6, the gap to Sam in front is now. 1.6 Incident in uphill That's Incident good in West Bend it looks like here weeks If you could go off again Sam that'd be awesome
Summit Point coming up. Might do that on Monday, I think. Uh, Jefferson Circuit would be awesome in these. These cars are just so made for the tiny tracks, and because they are um, rookie class, that's really what they're going to have. You've just done a 102.0. Sector 1 is 0.4 off the pace. You're two you tenths off the pace. Find these Sector being Sector three is shoved out at Spa. Awesome. There's an incident in left hander. It looks like it's Sam. Yellow flag. Keep your wits about you, mate. Top five. Leaders in sight. If they could do something stupid, that'd be awesome. We're halfway point at the end of this lap. That's half distance. You're looking good for fuel. Thing is, you see little puffs of smoke, but that's not collisions or locking up. That's gear changes or people coming off the throttle. Come on, guys, crash. Look at you all. Adams, it's getting closer. The gap's come down to 1.7 seconds. P5. Close though, in front, this is good. It's incredible, even though they're, so they only kick out about 45, 45 brake horsepower tops, and they do less than 100 miles an hour. It's just really exciting racing. There's an incident in left hander. I'm not going to do the series though, when the season that starts. Was, uh, No way. Too much rookie death when the season starts. Yellow flag. Incident in. Right hander. We think it might be Bedford. <laughs> Seriously, dudes. Push, 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 or we'll lose this place. There's an incident in. Downhill. we could still drive and been completely killed but that was really bad from the guy really bad yellow flag caution goodness me the, the, the driving standards and I mean this is supposed to be an entry-level race series for people to learn you got time to sort this out p8 to um, learn what they're doing and hopefully make Skip Barber less of a Ben Hur chariot race, but some of the driving stands I've seen so far have been absolutely diabolical. Nobody can stay comfortably close to another driver without killing them. So close together, those guys. Something has to happen. So there's going to be a lot of drafting in there. Who was it? Hit me? Was it Clinton Adams? No, the guy in third. You're a tenth off in sector one. Sector two is 0.6 off the pace. Sector three is 0.4 off the pace. Incident in Big Bend. It looks like it's Lundell. That's two minutes left. Two minutes. Another one Ten gone there. Fuel remaining. Careful how you come back on, my dude. Watch your right. Your right side's clear.
that's hustling behind, that's good. Well, I think that was actually somebody getting out of the way. So we're now we're back to sixth. Sixth place. That lap time was 102.7. Sam W just cannot keep it on the track at all. Absolutely useless. There's an incident in uphill. You think it might be Lundell and Sam? The thing is, these two guys in front, one of them's a lap down. You should just let him past. It's not your race. What's this guy doing? Good grief, okay, one more lap. Last lap. Finish six, or is this guy going to take him off? We got three cars. You're the middle one. Left side. We're clear on the left side. The right side's clear. Yellow flag. Watch out. We're dead. Two liters remain. Look at this. Adams is leading the race. We're running on fumes, mate. Who was that? Right. So the cause of that is Mark Bowden, who was lapsed down. And let's just see this again. Look at him diving up the insides. Why? Why is he doing this? Absolutely bizarre. Mark Bowden is an A-class driver as well. Takes him off. That's me done. Nowhere to go. Great. Has retired from the race. Okay, Matt. 15 minutes left. That's 15 minutes. And it's just complete carnage after that. Death, 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 everywhere. He's coming back on. Look at that, look at that. Charlie Gray. Another, that same helmet as the other Muppet. Anyway, where do we finish? Ninth in the end. So, uh, there it is. Thanks for watching. And uh, you can see why I'm not going to do that series. Um, see you for the next one.